I love the Stone Show at Spa. It provides me with an opportunity to make work outside of the industry and have a guaranteed showcase for it. So to be able to come in once a year, guaranteed an annual show, and combine with people who are also doing what I'm doing, it's, it's really refreshing. For the last 13 years, each fall, we've hosted a major stone sculpture event, and we're very pleased that in our 13th year, we have an outstanding show here at SPA involving stone assemblage and carvings. Upstairs on the second floor of Spa, we're exhibiting I Am You by Mary Stiles. It's a wonderful exhibit of drawings and monoprints. I really like the idea of uh, how we're all kind of interdependent and so um, how the things that I do in a day impact other people or other um, you know, creatures on the planet. And so those diagrams um, kind of came out of um, some primitive art that I had been looking at and I had uh, traveled a little bit to Australia and have been exposed to some Aboriginal art and, uh, and just kind of the simplicity of, of putting some images together. I, I know that the primitive art often looks like that and these things are sort of on this page disconnected as small as images but in my mind they're very much interdependent on one another and so I just started draw, kind of drawing them together and it felt very satisfying. On the third floor of Spa we have two artists showing their work. The first show is by Gabriel Tempesta. It's a show called the Bumblebee series and it's his interest to share a little bit more detail about the endangered bumblebees here in the state of Vermont as a public outreach activity. So I've just been fascinated with bees and I, I heard about this, you know, this issue and um, I figured that that would make a great series to, just to, to bring awareness. And I've, all, I've always been kind of curious what role visual arts can actually have in bringing awareness to a series. And this partly was to sort of answer that question. I, I don't feel like the images themselves are educating anybody about what is going on, but just by bringing them larger than life and putting them on a wall or in a gallery and then making people think about bumblebees and tying that to an artist statement, um, I do feel like it's just, it is good for raising awareness in that way. Also on the third floor, Susan Bull Riley is showing a group of botanical watercolors. Studio Place Arts is located at 201 North Main Street in downtown historic Barrie. Our hours are Tuesday through Friday, 10 a.m. until 5, Saturday noon to 4. Our website is www.studioplacearts.com. <laughs>